Hopping up, throw up the sex in her. What's up, y'all? Welcome to the first official podcast break. Um, podcast breaks, it's just basically going to be like mini vlogs or stuff in between podcasts. I just woke up. Happy New Year's. It's 2024. It's time for new beginnings. Cheers to new success. Cheers to making no excuses and going after everything that you want in life. And just cheers to living the lifestyle that you want all 2024. Um, I started, well, for New Year's Eve, I didn't do nothing. I stayed in the house. Um, I didn't really do too much. I need to get up and clean up today, but I also need to go find food. I don't know what's open for New Year's Day. Um, I stayed up till, let me see, I fell asleep listening to gospel music. But, um, before that, I was on FaceTime with my friend and, um, we always have a good conversation. So once um, me and him had got off the phone, I literally laid down and fell asleep listening to gospel music. And I woke up um, like a few minutes later because I realized that I was listening to gospel music. But I always, you know, fall asleep listening to rain sounds. Um, I woke up and he had texted me and then my best friend had also texted me. So I just replied back to them and literally went back to sleep. But... I am about to get up and get dressed to see if I can figure out what restaurants are open today. I'm pretty sure a lot of restaurants are open today. Um, it's not like Christmas where everything is completely closed. But if all else, if all else fails, Waffle House. <laughs> it's always the main thing open. And what else? Um, I'm, I really want, for some reason, I don't know. I just really want some Bojangles, like an egg and cheese biscuit with some fries. That's what I really want. But we're about to get up, get dressed, and yeah. Welcome to the first podcast break. All right, so I didn't got up, got dressed, about to go to. Actually, I I said both jungles at first, but I'm thinking more Biscuitville. Y'all, this is like the best synthetic wig I don't have. Like, baby, like who you know? I need to figure out what what brand of hair this was. What I'm looking for. My keys. I'm turn off this light. Grab my keys. I'm gonna keep my little heater thing on. I typically don't because. Oh, where is my taco? All right, so got my pocketbook, my keys, my wallet. Let's get. to get more comfortable with you know just taking my camera out um like outside in public with me like not forgetting my camera for anything no matter where i'm going whether it's the work or etc but um i feel like that's just the first start to becoming a successful content creator like or youtuber like you have to be able to take your camera around without Without being nervous, of course it's gonna be a little. But I, my camera's a little bit small, so I don't think. Okay, obviously it wanna do whatever it wants to do, but my camera's a little small, so I don't really, you know, have a anything too big to carry around. But it's still just that, you know, initial thought. But I saw something yesterday. Well, this girl had um, a tripod in the car like she had a, a standing up tripod in the car and i think i saw that on tiktok so i'm like i need to get me a big enough tripod to bring in a car not unless i just you know use my phone for the parts of the video that i want to record in the car or whatever but i'm gonna talk to y'all once i get to biscuitville because normally the line is super long 
I don't know why I decided to go here first. I should have just checked with Bojangles first, but I really want Biscuitville again. I had it yesterday. Um, if y'all like Biscuitville, or if y'all even know what Biscuitville is, comment down below and let me know, like, what's your favorite thing to get from Biscuitville? Okay, so obviously you're gonna be a little petty. You're not gonna let me over, but I'm gonna cut in front of you anyway. So yeah. This line is always wrapped around the building. So y'all, every time I come to this Biscuitville, like this line is always wrapped around the building. Like, was she working yesterday? I think she was working yesterday. She can probably remember me. <laughs> but um, this line is always wrapped around. Like, I feel like it's another Biscuitville here somewhere, but it's like, 20 minutes from where I stay. This is like mm, like a rough eight minutes. It could be five minutes depending on traffic. But it's always it's always like wrapped around. Oh yeah, that's the same lady from yesterday. She's gonna be like, girl, I remember you. <laughs> but yeah. I'm trying to figure out, like I need to clean up today so I think I might just include that all in this little podcast break. So like I said, I'm not gonna call my vlogs uh, no, maybe I am gonna, I don't know, I think, I like, I don't want to call it like a podcast break, because this is really, I mean, it's gonna be a podcast channel, but I also want to like vlog and stuff, like, for the New Year's, I'm trying to change things up a little bit on your channel, on my channel, you know, so, that's all I'm saying. Like most of the videos will be consistent of like podcasts and sit down videos. Oh, you know what? I was thinking about doing the Q and A. So the next video after this will probably be like an updated get to know me type video. Um, because I haven't did one of those since, I did one while I lived here. So it was either like a year or two ago, but definitely like much more blessings, much more opportunities have presented itself. So, I want to be able to, you know, share that and then, you know, just, just fill y'all in with what's been going on with your girl. But I'm going to talk to y'all as soon as this line gets where it needs to be because obviously it's wrapped around the building. But I'm a very patient person. I always come here and sit in this line and just be minding my business. So now see, that's what I'm talking about. Why would you even pull right there? Because you got to let... This is why it's a stop sign over here. Cause stuff like this. You don't block the the exit from where people are trying to go. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit y'all up once this line get get a little bit. How about I left my whole phone at the house? And typically I don't keep money in my regular like bank account. I always keep it in my savings because I just transfer out whatever I need, but I can't believe I left my phone at the house. See, that's what I'm saying. I got to get used to grabbing the camera, grabbing the phone, everything, but it's cool. I ain't mad. I mean, I had my, you know, my credit cards and stuff, but I'm going to just go back to the house, get my phone. I knew I left something. I'm like, something is just not adding up, but whatever. There's other breakfast places around there where I'm probably going to go get some, like, um, some French toast or something, but I just wanted to come on here and let y'all know I freaking forgot my phone. But yeah. So apparently I didn't have anything with me. I didn't have my phone. I didn't have my wallet. Like I checked in my bag and I'm like, okay, you know, let me, let me see where my wallet is. I look in my bag and I'm like, I need my wallet. But luckily before I got too far out, I was able to just turn back around, come back and get my wallet. Like I already came back, got my phone and I had to come back again and get my wallet. See, that's what, this is what happens when I'm trying to grab the camera and all this happened so got my wallet got my phone and i got my watch on just in case i yeah so whatever we got everything let's go find some food so i'm fine i feel some type of way i went to biscuitville i didn't end up eating there of course because i didn't have my wallet or my phone so i couldn't you know transfer my funds over Okay, so then I was like, well, I'm just going to go to breakfast time. I go by there. They're closed. Waffle House is packed. 
at a Taco Bell and I'm like, okay, they got lights on, they got cars there, but I sat there for like five minutes and nobody said anything on the little drive through intercom. So now I'm back. Well, now I'm at the original place that I said I was going to go to in the first place. I should have just went here first because that's what I originally wanted, which was Bojangles. Like, why didn't I just go here first? So I didn't went to like five different places today. Luckily, I got a full tank of gas because... I mean, dang. Sheesh. Well, I guess it's just because I'm off and I be thinking everybody should be open. Because I'm off. Oh, not you leaving. Has this line been long? If I could say in Biscuitville line, I could say in this line. They ordering, so I don't think... But yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know that... I went to like five different places. And this is typically how holidays go. I was just gonna go to Walmart and get some, um, or go to the grocery store and just get some food to cook. But at the same time, I'm like, I'm not in the, in the mood to cook. But not only that, like I have to start packing soon because I'm moving. And so I don't wanna take out any dishes. I don't wanna, you know. Oh, baby, you should've backed up because but yeah, so um, I'll let y'all know when I get back home. Oh, and we're going to take a trip to Lowe's too because I need to go get um, cut a piece of my carpet and then do the little carpet sample thing because obviously my dog liked to have fun with the carpet. And so we're going to, that's going to be our little project today. I did see that Lowe's was open. I saw cars in the parking lot and I saw their doors open. So if I get there and it's something different, I'm going to be upset. But I mean, can you get off me a little bit? But yeah, so that's what that's what that's the plan today. So after I eat, I'm um get myself together. I just need to eat first, and then we're gonna go cut a piece of the carpet in the back room. Um, and I'm gonna go to Lowe's, get a free carpet sample, and I might have to go to two different Lowe's because I need like two different ones just in case. And I need to also get I think I saw on TikTok like some carpet tape or something. So that's, that's what we're going to be doing today. We ain't going to sit in the house today on New Year's. No, we're going to go out and we're going to be productive today. So yeah. Oh, not a lot of cars behind me. But anyway, I'll get back on here once I get back home and eat some food. And then we're getting ourselves together to go to Lowe's. So... So I think I think I found a good match. Wait, sorry. This is what I was looking for, and this is what I found. And it looks like a good match so far. So I'm gonna just try these out. I'm about to find some double-sided tape. And Okay, so finally made it out of Lowe's. I'm still sitting here in the parking lot. So I end up, I was trying to find like carpet tape, but everything I kept seeing was like double-sided Gorilla tape. I scratched my hand trying to find carpet. Um, so I ended up just having to pay $7. 
So again, this is the one I was looking for. Y'all can see a little bit better because I'm in a car now. That's the one I was looking for. And these are the ones I found that was super close. Or if not, I'm just say super close. I'm not gonna say the same. But see, this is the match. Like it's a little bit off, but you can. It's pretty much so far the same color. So then I got some Gorilla Glue. So I'm gonna just use this and you know paste it down or whatever once I really do it. But I think I'm gonna just wait until my dog. Um, I have someone that's gonna watch my dog for me while I like move and stuff. So that way, hey, we came in, came out at the same time. Um, watch my dog so that way I can like really clean up and then really put this down because the tea is I'm moving two weeks before my lease is up. Um, so I'll be able to go back in and then like, you know, get the stuff right. I'm gonna have to, um, I was going to buy some paint, but I should have took like a sample maybe of the, I got the little, um, wall stuff to patch holes. I don't really have holes in my wall except from like mountain, but they're like itty bitty tiny holes that you can barely see, but I'm going to get some stuff to y'all. This is going to be a long vlog, but I'm trying to see cause. Do these not come off on the back? I don't think. Whatever. I just tried to take this off and. Let me show y'all. Oh, never mind. It's trying to. It's trying to come off. But they got these babies stuck on here. Am I supposed to? Yeah, whatever. I'm trying to take it off and. Like, it's just not having it. Let me to clear up, but. So yeah, I'm a little bit hungry now. I feel like that um, that Bojangles did not hold me over. I'm trying to figure out if I want to eat now while I'm out or like again, or I just want to go home because if I go home, I'm not, not really doing nothing. And I know most places are closing early today because it's New Year's. Um, let me see. I think I'm gonna just go home. And then if the Chinese places are open regular hours. So I just get like Chinese tonight or something like that because that'll hold me over to tomorrow. I'm probably gonna work from home tomorrow, depending, or I may go in the office because typically with holiday time, it's a little bit more backed up and stuff like that. So I may just go into the office tomorrow and then just work from home the rest of the week. But we'll see. Not talking about 10, I'm probably just gonna go home and then just come back out later too, to get food, cause I don't mind. <laughs> All right, so I just came out of Walmart because I forgot that I needed to come and get some trash, some big trash bags and some laundry detergent. About to go ahead and wash some clothes. Um, and then, like I said, as far as starting the packing process. So I got a whole bunch of shoes and clothes that I just need to get rid of because there's just so much that I just don't need. Some clothes I don't even wear. Um, it's clothes that has been sitting in a bin <laughs> since I moved. So I'm just going to put all of that in a trash bag because obviously if I haven't um, looked at it by now, then it's no point of me. That's why your car looked the way it do. Um, it's no point of me to keeping it. Why am I going to keep holding on to, I just feel like extra stuff that I need to let go of. It's a new year. It's time to let go. Yo, somebody just pushed a basket. Hold on. Somebody just pushed a basket. I'm gonna see if I can zoom in a little bit. Somebody just pushed that basket out and it kept rolling. Well, I wonder if it was this lady. Oh no, she's gonna fix it, but good Samaritan. But that was insane. So yeah, so I'm just about to go home. I'm going to wash clothes, just reset, um, clean up, and like that was so sweet of her. She didn't have to do that. But um, yeah, so now we're really on the way home. Um, this is the wrong way. This is definitely the wrong way. <laughs> 